I've just been doing some random things here. Uh, decided that I'm wearing this for right now. Probably gonna switch out the sword to something different, like the Baldur Side Sword or Claymore. But right now, this is what I got. I spent all all of my souls, pretty much, buying uh, alluring skulls, prisms. So, okay, I mean, I still had some, but uh, I got up to 30 or 40 of them so that I can actually use them if I need to, because only bones would be the ones I'd use more often, I think. But the prisms, I may, I found one use for it, although it didn't really help. I died anyway, but that was only because I ran out. So I try to get enough this time where it won't run out in case I run into the same situation. And, um... Yeah, anyway, I'm out of money. I did put some souls, I banked some souls for an emergency. Like the soul of the hero and uh, soul of some brave warriors. So. I don't know when I'll have an emergency. Doesn't make any sense, but hey. Do that in real life, so I'm doing it in the game. Put some savings away. All right, uh, here I still haven't reinforced for the last one I got. So here we go. Now we're up to five. And I want to go the wizard, which was going a bit insane. I want to go check on him again to see if he's okay. Since I can get there really quick. I may skip this if it's if there's nothing going on. But is that the right one? I think so. So much to do in this game. It's so hard. I mean I have so many options right now of of places to head towards. Now, I still have uh, the Four Kings, which I know where they're at. They're in the Abyss, but I need to get a ring before I can go there. The Witch, I'm pretty sure I know where the Witch is located, some some place, which is she was consumed by Chaos Fire, uh, according to the story I got. And therefore, I'm thinking that the Ceaseless Discharge was kind of like protecting her rim. And now that he's gone, I can probably walk into her rim. I probably had to defeat those guards first, but she's probably that her rim is over there. We got all that place that's down from the uh, lava falls in which you can see buildings. And then we got the chaos, the thing that looks like an elevator that's uh, in the Daughter of Chaos outer chamber. So I'm pretty sure Although not positive, but pretty sure that the witch that I need the soul of is in there. The Grave Lord, that's the one that's a bit of a puzzle to me. Now, I did get into a coffin once. That, that I didn't got out of. I didn't stay in the coffin. So, I'm not sure if I remember where it was. It was somewhere in the catacombs, but uh, I don't not sure if I can. I may have to go back and watch my uh, video of that and see where it was. Uh, great, he's gone. Well, that didn't take long, so... Drats. Alright, since he's gone, I bet if I go back now... I mean, I don't know, but I bet if I go back to Firelink, his apprentice will be gone too, because he said he was going to look for him eventually. These people. Uh, 
Man, Catalina's daughter's gone. I mean, almost everybody's gone here. Let's see if he's gone. No, he's still here. Oh, hello. Why, of course I don't mind teaching you sorceries. But now that you've located Master Logan, I can't imagine that I can be of much help. I have decided to seek the Regal Archives. I realize that I may never make it, but I would feel worthless if I did not at least try. What other choice do I have to earn Logan's recognition? I don't know. I have decided to seek the Regal Archives. I realize that I may never make it, but I would feel worthless if I did not at least try. What other choice do I have to earn Logan's recognition? I well, don't even have enough money to buy that. Goodbye then. Do stay safe. All right. All right, so let's go to... Daughter of Chaos, just because I want to see what's going on down here. Guess I'll switch to... Spider Shield. Wonder if anything out here would have changed. Since I've given the quest to go check it out. Wait. Is this the right place? Am I lost? Now let's go a little bit further. Yeah, okay. These are the same people. Nobody changed here. This looks about the same. Now, you see, I got these guys down here that I would have to kill. Then I got that guard there that I probably would have to kill in order to get by that direction. So I think I have a couple options this way for the witch. Or what I assume will be the witch. feel more like I'd like to go after the ring or maybe check out so I don't want to do this one yet uh, I have a desire to try to figure out uh, the grave lord Nito one but first let's go see who all died and is now here because Katrina Katrina whatever his name, her name is that went after her dad are both missing so they're probably down here to team up on me to try to kill me so let's go see if that's true trying to figure out probably need to switch to different ring which is going to make me different ring is going to make me vulnerable But, I don't guess it can be helped. What's my poise now? It's probably less than 40. Yeah, 28. So, basically I can be stunned, so I just need to remember that. Oh, doesn't look like they're here. Wendy right there. Oh no, there he is. 
Oh, he, and he looks alert if that's him. Maybe that's her. The poison swamp. I quicksand in there. Hmm. So your daughter didn't find you? The poison swamp. I quicksand in there. Hmm. Oh, well, that was interesting. I thought for sure the daughter would be here. All right. Looking at all these guys being undisturbed makes me want to go farming. But I need to stay on track. I need not get diverted to other tasks. Don't quite get it. I think I got plenty of these larges anyway, so I don't believe I need any more. Not exactly as I thought. Oh, and one other thing is I need to read. Soul of the Bino Seth the Scaleless, a fragment of the Lord's soul discovered at the dawn of the Age of Fire. Seth allied with Lord Gwyn and turned upon the dragons, and for this he was awarded dukedom, embraced by the royalty and given a fragment of a great soul. Although just a piece, it will still satiate the Lord Vessel. Crystal Ember. Ember required for weapon ascension. Crystal Ember created by Seth the Scaleless, handled only by the giant gods blacksmiths. Send a plus 10 standard weapon to crystal weapon. Crystal weapons are powerful but brittle and cannot be repaired once broken. Broken pennant. This is the other thing I got. Half of a broken stone pennant. The vine appears to originate from 
Oh, and that was that girl that sat down by the Hydra. Dusk. That's her world. A powerful magic that can be sensed from this ancient storm. Yet men of this time can neither manipulate nor sense its power, which has a distinct air consisting of both reference and nostalgia. Now we remember that there were some things that we got from her. See, now these have uh, requirements that I meet. Uh, hidden weapon, fall control, hush, hidden body, repair. Cast light, that could be handy. Hey, I wonder if the cast light thing would work in that one area. Million, okay, I can't do remedy. this curse all those uh, intellect 14 in a row there were all from her world so I have yet to try any of those things I should try just to see what they do so you know, maybe soon well sacrifice the humanity to undo a curse So I can't, I can't use this anyway because it requires one more point than I have. So that's something to consider whether I should, should want to increase that or not. All right, so I'm going to leave for now. I haven't made a decision on what to do. I'm leaning more towards checking out that coffin again. But I'm looking at going to catacombs dressed like this. I'm not sure what my best options are. But what I'm wearing right now allows me to do a medium roll and gives me poise of 75. Which is pretty good. Just going to see how this works on the skeletons. All right, worked okay. It'd be interesting to see if I can hit them more than one with with one hit. Right now, the way what's happening is that. I was taking on each at one time. I could do a sweep with it. I need to try to do a sweep. Get another set of skeletons. There, I got both. Yep, I'm both dead. So that worked out well. I remember when this these guys were really really tough and now they're uh, now just one swing and I kill off two of them ah, I missed that one ah, 
So this this thing will, I think will work okay against the skeletons in the catacombs. I think I've killed off all the necromancers, so they probably can't be resurrected anyway. I meant to increase my discovery. It needs to be high enough, but I don't know if I have enough humanity, so I probably need to go hunting for them. Get a few more. So, I, I'm going to have to go hunting for them, so I'll be back after I get some. Okay, I believe we're ready to head out now and see what type of damage we can do. These guys will be back. Do the little sweeping move. I missed one of them. I got it. Get both of them. You notice the other one didn't actually attack me because I was too, too quiet. He didn't understand. If I'm going to be this quiet, how can I possibly be attacked? So I kind of like my quietness. That's advantages. I got my. Uh, Humanities up to where they need to be, so I got the high discovery. That worked pretty good. Yeah, I believe the spear is going to work out fine in catacombs. Notice my poise was working that time because I got hit and I was able to finish my swing. So that's what we're looking for. So we just head off down to the catacombs now. Yeah, we're just going to just look at the entrance here just to see what actually happens with this first little skeleton that's here. Yeah, he's on the ball. He's ready to attack. Okay. Yeah, that looks like it works okay. I'm supposed to be resistant to bleed damage, and it looks like I am to some extent. It's going to take more than just two or three hits to get me into the bleed damage realm now. Which is good. That's because of my new shield that I'm carrying. I like to try to use my bombs. I should have a whole bunch. Um, like a hundred. I thought I got a whole bunch, but this only shows one. So I need to go get more bombs. So this is not. Uh, I need to buy however many bombs I can buy it with 4,000. I might have gotten confused between this character and another character where I bought a hundred bombs. But I thought for sure I bought a hundred bombs. I can remember buying them. But yeah, maybe it wasn't this character. Right? Alternating characters uh, gets you a little confused. I like not making noise when I run. I probably can sneak pretty well too. I should test this out in some places to see how it works. Okay, I'll be back in a little bit. Uh, I'm just out here trying to get uh, 40,000 gold. And one of the things I'm finding out is that I can sneak up on these guys. I don't know about this one. But I snuck up on a couple of guys. 
because of the silence. Yeah, can this guy too. That's crazy. Now breaking a um, shield defense not quite as easy with this. Okay, that looked like it was just as easy. But I tried it a second ago and it wasn't as easy. <laughs> Let's try the one around the corner. Oh, something about this uh, spear I like. Uh, it like, tries to kill everything around. Not just what you're trying to aim for. All right, let's see how this guy goes. Same. The sneaking up on people is a pretty easy thing. Pretty easy. Yeah, I need 40,000. Now, I have a lot of souls in the bank. So I might could use that, but I want to upgrade. I want to level. And the reason I want to level is because I want to um, get to 14. Because I believe at 14, I get another slot, spell slot. Yeah, I'm talking about the attunement. Uh, and right now it's 13. I need, need for it to get to 14. So I'm trying to decide whether I wanted to um, wear a ring in order to get the spell slot or if I would be happier just leveling. So I finally decided I'd just rather level. That way I can keep my sneaky ring on, although I probably won't do that either. I wonder if we could sneak up on these guys with a... What can I cast? I can cast light. Alright, so that's pretty worthless. So let's get you back to what you were. And here, I can cast this. Eventually. Yeah, I don't know what good this is. Oh, that worked pretty good. And that guy there didn't even notice. Which I'm pretty sure I can sneak up and stab him in the back now. So oh, being quiet is kind of handy for sneaking up on things. They got their back turned to you. Probably can't really do anything with this guy here. Well, it just shows you poise at work. Alright, I kind of wanted to try out this, um... Sweeping kit? I started out this way because I was planning on buying some bombs. But it turned out the vendor that sells the bombs I killed. So, I took his weapon. And the other vendors that I've checked so far haven't had selling of bombs. So I'm getting ready to go upstairs in this building and check out this vendor, which I'm pretty sure he doesn't sell bombs. That sounds crazy for him. Okay, let's go check out the vendor up here. Good tidings. 
Laudable. I'm thinking about abandoning being my covenant. Chaos uh, plus two, but that cost me 30 souls, so, uh, or 30 humanities. But humanity is pretty easy to come by from those rats, so that's like 30 minutes of work now. Mm, great. No, no. Why? Why? You're not welcome any time. It is only human to commit a sin. <laughs> Wow. All the way back to here, huh? Now, how come this isn't any higher? Do they quit being... I don't want to kindle everybody. Load this back up and then I'm gonna go look at Firelink to see if it's back to I may have been wasting this all these times. Well that still looks like it's 20. certainly isn't a very big fire. I don't know if it needs to be. All right. like it's well, this looks like I could almost walk through here every single time I look like I could walk through there almost all right that give me 20 yeah So I can come here and farm immediately instead of the stupid thing I've been doing. Oh, this is irritating. Well, it's not irritating. It's actually good to know. It's irritating that I didn't know it. <laughs> All right, let's see. Where are you? Well, apparently you're not high enough. All right, so let's...
right, so now I'm going to spend some time here. Let's see if I can get Max Adam Discovery, because I need that. do I need? I don't remember where I was at. Okay. Two more. had one that time. Well, that was an excellent round. Like, seven out of ten rats had a Humanity. Well, that's 10,000. How many more do I need? Twenty seven thousand. Yeah, I don't think I got that many souls, but I probably got like 20,000. So if I go out and get it, I need a few more thousand. So where could I go first? Oh, I know where I can go. I never made it to the bottom of that hollow place. So let me just go there and get to the bottom, see what's there. Warp to Dollar Chaos. We'll pick this up next episode. See you then. Bye.